The verse for the day is taken from Psalm 34 verse 4. I sought the Lord and he heard me and delivered me from all my troubles, from all my fears. Have you heard this term fear run? What do you do when you suddenly realize that your enemy is behind you? What do you do when you're unnecessarily targeted for no fault of yours? Where do you run? You have two options, either to run towards God or run in your own direction. And David experienced both. When he was chased by Saul, he ran into the caves to hide. And the Bible says he also acted like a madman. You know, my friends, when fear grips us, we panic and we do not know which direction to run to. Even the people of Israel, when they came out of Egypt, the Bible says they came out with boldness. And then they realized that the enemies were behind them and they began to live in fear. And they started complaining and grumbling and murmuring. Remember, just one look at the enemy, they began to murmur. And that can happen to you and me. When fear grips us, it all depends on which direction are you looking. Are you looking at the enemy or are you looking towards God? And David realized that the, his hiding places are not enemy proof. The only one who can hide him is the Lord. That is why he said, I sought the Lord and he heard me and delivered me from all my fears. Look at the confidence. This confidence and courage comes from the deep relationship with the Lord. He knew for sure that when he runs to the Lord, he will surely hide. My friend, it does not matter what your fear is. It does not matter how long you're living with fear. But I can tell you today, the only place of deliverance, the place of security, the place of saf safety is the Lord and the Lord himself. And this prayer can be your prayer and my prayer. You and I can also say this. I sought the Lord. He heard me and delivered me from all my fears. Hold on to this promise more than the promise. Hold on to the promise giver. God bless you.